Hello po! Come in, please introduce yourself to our viewers. Yeah. Manayaw, uh, maayong adlaw sa tanan o dalaygon. I'm Jerry Oxales from Davao City of Mr. Gay World 2024. Maayong gabi. Maayong gabi. <laughs> 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 see you, see you po doon. <laughs> So far sa Mr. Gay World, um, I experienced a lot. I met new friends, new family, uh, gained um, new memories and treasure uh, the, the happy moments na, na, na experience ko sa aking journey dito sa Mr. Gay World. Alright, so right now is the first day of Pride Month. Yes, it's the first day of Pride Month. Happy Pride Month, everyone. Happy Um, Pride Mind for me is um, this is the celebration of the LGBTQ um, plus community uh, we, where we can showcase our talent, our um, not just talent, our showcase ourselves and to be true to ourselves. That's my uh, Pride Month. Yes, thanks to Love Yourself and thanks to ha for having us here at um, Central Park, Pasig for celebrating um, Pride Month. Yes, sir. Kanina ay nasa stage kayo to be introduced to the public and the event of Catholic Mr. Gamer Philippines. What does it feel that you have been introduced to thousands of people tonight? <laughs> I was not expecting that, but I was an. It's an honor for me to uh, to have that kind of questions. Um, the question for me is how can I, um, or how can I uh, give an advice to to people or to to my members of LGBT community who are who are um, in pain or in the process of um, not not show uh, not showcasing the, to the, their true self. So I guess I was also bullied. And I was also uh, neglected, not just by my family, but also in our community. But here I am today, standing in front of you, um, representing uh, my nation. I mean, not nation, my um, province, which is Davao. That um, I've been, uh, like, uh, what do you call this one? Uh, I've been bullied, yes, I've been bullied, but... Here I am standing in front of you, um, raising my flag as who I am and showcasing my true self as, as being me. I'm sorry I didn't ask this earlier, so maybe know your profession or your job at the moment. Ah, okay. Um, I'm a nurse by profession specializing in hemodialysis. And also I'm an event organizer in Davao and I do styling, I do coordinating as well. Yes, well. And I know that well, the medical field has been very important for us, but especially in our community. So, what do you think that now is the time to be nurses in the um, I think uh, kaya mababa yung mga nurses natin ngayon dito sa, sa Philippines it's because they are not well compensated um, I experience as well um, I'm not that compensated in my own profession um, but if we're working abroad uh, we could have um, you know we could uh, we could uh, help our parents not just our parents also our siblings um, to, to our daily needs uh, like school, um, house, the necessity itself that we could we could buy to our family if we are working abroad. But here in the Philippines, I hope our our government would um, you know raise fundings for us, mostly in the medical field, uh, to raise our salary for us not to go to abroad anymore. Ah, my advocacy is the stigma about HIV AIDS awareness. Um, stigma, it's because a lot of our community, mostly to, our, to know their self, uh, they are afraid for having tested uh, because of, uh, because of uh, what do you think, neglection. 
Number one. Number two, discrimination. And number three, hatred. So, that's what I am fighting for. Know yourself, know your status, whatever people will, will say to you. But still, you need to love yourself. Know your status. Because if you don't, you will end that, you know, uh, much, much worse. Yes. 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 Because if you are positive, we all we all because if you are positive, we all, we already have medications. Um, but still, it's not that uh, to cure, but to sleep the virus or the 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 bacteria itself. So be tested and drink your meds regularly. Uh, what was that again? Uh, do you think that our laws are already enough to uh, protect our... Laws? Ah, okay. Uh, for me, um, based on my field as a nurse, um, due to um, the, the percentage and due to the lowest age who are positive today is around 12 or 13 years old. So it's quite um, alarming. So for me, uh, the medication, yes, it is well for now, but I know there will be more and I hope um, so one day there will be a cure for this kind of illness or this kind of virus. And right now, um, so GSC is still under reading, but lower... Soji bill. Okay, Soji Bill for me is, um, I'm a pro Soji Bill, but there's a pros and cons. In every law, there's a pros and cons. But um, we need to accept the, 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 the consequence itself. But for, for me, Soji Bill uh, is really, uh, I'm a pro for it um, because I want us to be, you know, I want us to be part of the community. We are, we are part of the community, not just to be fan of the community. We are not just the, the clowns of the community, but we are also part of the community. We are more I'm, we are more talented because we have the heart of a woman but the strength of a man. Alright, and lastly, what's your message to all Dabawenos who are very proud of you representing them here at Research Team Procellities 2024? Oh yes, um Satanan mga Can I <laughs> Um, so tanan mga taga Davaoenos, please do support me in my journey here in Mr. Gay World 2024 and I hope uh, we'll get a spot on the semi-finals. And still, um, kanang ayaw mo kundang ug support sa ako. Dagang salamat og dalaygon! <laughs> Thank you po. Thank you po. Yes. Yes. I see you. I know. We're having our semifinals in June 21 at the crib. We'll have uh, we'll showcasing uh, local designers, Filipino local designers and also our swimwear competition. So please do support us at the crib. Um, tickets are av available for only 1000 pesos po. Okay. We'll surely be there of course. <laughs> Thank you, thank you.